I'm glad you asked. Yes, there are other PVC composite boards out there available on the market. They're not just AZEC. Two brands, which you're probably trying to figure out right now which one is better, is Wolf Serenity and Zuri. Both a PVC core, which you can enjoy for a long time with all the benefits of PVC over composite decking. But before you go out to the store and decide which one you're gonna pick and have that dumbfounded look when you walk up to the salesperson and say, hey, I would like some PVC decking, let's go through a little bit of a little overview of the two brands to see which one is you're better looking at and spending your time at the store looking for. First of all, appearance wise, this is the biggest thing, the biggest reason why you buy PVC decking is that how it looks and it's gonna look amazing, both brands. But both brands distinctly look different. One, Wolf Serenity has more colors. It has 11 different colors, both in the Seaside collection, if I can just grab one right here. Biggest distinction between the Seaside collection and the Hardwood collection is Seaside is more of a basic color. Yes, it still has the wire brush finish, but it's a basic color. As opposed to, if you look at the, this is a driftwood gray here. So let's just compare the Seaside driftwood gray here. See how much color you have? Cause that's the hardwood collection where they put a little bit more money into giving you more color variation. The black streaking, which makes it just pop when it's out on your deck. Compare this to Serenity PVC decking. You're gonna see two very distinctly different looking boards. Zuri has a photorealistic image of hardwood on there, like your Wolf Serenity at all. It is a distinctly different look. It's got the PVC core, but it's got a distinct photo image on the top, which is gonna give you a much different look. And you're much more limited what kind of hardwood selection you have. They have a total of six different colors, which I'm not gonna go through all with here, but it is something to be considered. It's gonna look much different on your deck if you install Zuri as opposed to installing Wolf Resistance. So something that's often overlooked that you shouldn't overlook when you're buying decking is slip resistance, the traction that you're gonna have when you're out on your deck. So first of all, I'm a little bit disappointed recently with Zuri because CCMC redid their report on them, giving them a much lower rating than what they used to have, but they still have a very good rating. In fact, between the two, there's almost no difference in the amount of traction you're gonna feel when you're walking on the deck. Wolf Serenity is just a little bit better. Add some water on there and it becomes even better, but they both beat the 0.5 traction rate, rating, which is recommended. So you're gonna have good traction or slip resistance on both of them, but Wolf Serenity will just give you a little bit more grip. In regards to pricing, now of course, with the solid color, that's gonna cost you less. You're looking somewhere around the six to eight dollar range for the whole Wolf Serenity. I really hesitate to say in prices these days because as we all know, prices seem to be all over the map right now, but Wolf Serenity is priced a little lower level than Zuri Deccan. And that's where Zuri Deccan is not priced for the entry level. This is not your starter decking board to see, hey, do I like composite decking? Is it gonna work for my house? No, Zuri Deccan is priced for your dream decking. It's gonna cost you way more than Wolf Serenity, but you are not getting a deck that's looking like all the other decks on the block. Zuri's decking is gonna look distinctly different and you're gonna pay a little bit extra for that price. Probably about 50% more, but the price range is quite great, especially compared to where you are shopping and where you're getting the boards. So something to keep in mind there. In regards to durability though, like how long will your deck last? So Wolf Serenity is kind of interesting little boards here. I'm just gonna grab another sample here if I can show it. So one thing I like about them, so see, you got your nice impossible on the top here, your, 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 your color and et cetera, all that's all right there. If you flip the board over, you have the exact same thing on the other side. So Wolf Serenity is capped on all four sides, but it's also colored and embossed on all four sides. So if while you're building your deck, you accidentally scratch the decking, just flip it over. You're good to go, no big issue. And even if like 20 years down the road, the same thing has happened to you. Somehow you pulled your chair across your deck and you got a little scratch on there, back the fasteners over, Flip it over and you're all brand new again. 
This is something you can't do with Zuri, because Zuri just has a, sorry, they got a sticker on the bottom here, but just has a white core on the bottom. You can't flip them over. What you have on the top is all you've got. But one thing I do love about Zuri Composite Decking, as opposed to Wolf Serenity, is how the cap is finished. If you actually look very closely there, the light is almost perfectly on there. I was actually doing a scratch test a few days ago. And Zuri test decking is amazing how well it can hold up to an actual screw scratching back and forth on it. It doesn't actually really scratch through the cap. It will fade it a little bit if we get the light just right. But it's incredible of the level of resistance it has. Their studies have said it's 30% more durable than similar PVC decking. And it's five times more resistance to wear which is phenomenal. It's gonna be a decking that's gonna last. Even though you're paying a little bit more for it, it's gonna last and it's gonna look good much longer than your Wolf Serenity decking. Unfortunately, Zuri disappoints me with that incredible durability that they offer and how it's designed and built when it comes actually down to warranty. Because Wolf Serenity, hands down, has a way better warranty than Zuri. Twice as long. Zuri Deccan is going to give you 25 year fade stain structural warranty. Wolf Serenity gives you over 50 years of warranty. 51 years and over, they give you still a 10% resilient warranty on there. So with your Wolf Deccan, you're pretty much guaranteed for life. It's going to look good and it's going to stay on your deck in good condition. Where Zuri, well, you got 25 years, probably longer than you're going to live in your house but it's not gonna last nearly as long as your Wolf Serenity deck. And Wolf Serenity, if installed by a certified Wolf installer, gives you a five year labor warranty. So some reason rather than the first five years your decking fails, they'll not only pay for the decking, but they'll pay for the labor to tear off the old damaged decking and reinstall the new decking, which is very valuable. Zuri decking doesn't have that. Something unique about Zuri's labor or Zuri's Deck in warranty though, you see that? That beautiful color? You're not gonna want that to fade. And Zuri knows that. Their color is what sets them apart as a Deccan offering. So Zuri's Deccan warranty is 25 years, 100% for fading. So 24 years from now, your Zuri Deccan, it's gonna look the exact same color it does now. Well, within five Delta E's, which you can't even see with your naked eyes, or they're gonna replace it. That makes Zuri Deccan's fade warranty incredible. But it's only 25 years, as opposed to Wolf Serenity, which is a 50 year, but it's prorated and goes down in value over time. So hopefully you like what you see. 